Hi, I'm Peter Rubart, the music director of the Pensacola Symphony Orchestra. When you think Viennese classics, you think Haydn, Mozart, Beethoven. Now we play a lot of Mozart and Beethoven, and for this concert, we're gonna play a whole lot of Haydn, one of my very favorite composers. I'm always amazed at the variety that Haydn has. We're gonna play a piece that's incredibly serious. It's the depiction of chaos. It's the opening of his oratorio, The Creation. And in this mysterious, dark, kind of gloomy five, minute piece, he creates an unbelievable sense of uncertainty and unease chaos, in effect. Then we'll go on from there to the funny side of Haydn, because he was a laugh-out-loud funny composer. He wrote music for a play called Il Distrato that has all kinds of slapstick in it, like messed up tuning and things like that. Lots of fun with that. Scott Kluxdahl, one of my favorite cellists, will return to Pensacola for the Cello Concerto, probably the greatest of all of Haydn's concertos. After intermission, we have other guests, the chorus from the University of West Florida, as well as the chorist from Pensacola Christian College, joining us for Haydn's Te Deum, a piece written for the Empress Maria Theresa, a magnificent, bright, festive, sacred piece. And then, of course, the Haydn that's perhaps best known, the master symphonist. He wrote 104 symphonies, and frankly, they're all pretty great. The one that we're going to do this time is number 100. It's known as the military symphony, because in the last movement, as a surprise, Haydn throws in snare drums and bass drums and cymbals and other percussion instruments. Wonderful way to close a program of one of my favorite composers, Franz Josef Haydn. Hope to see you there.